Wembley's history and relationship with Thorne goes back to 1972 to the original stadium floodlighting. At this time Wembley had a football pitch as well as a sports track that ran around the outside. Thorne lit both with 240 metal halide floodlights for the pitch and 84 floodlights for the sports track. Jumping along in time to 2005, when the new Wembley Stadium was completed, Thorne provided the vast majority of the lighting throughout the stadium, installing over 40,000 luminaires across seven floors, both internally and externally, including the restaurants, circulation spaces, kitchens and of course the pitch. The current pitch lighting system uses the most efficient metal halide light sources available at over 100 lumens per watt, ideal for the colour, illuminance and flicker requirements for TV broadcasting. To this day, Thorne provides technical support for lighting measurements of the pitch lighting and general technical and lighting design support throughout the stadium. We are now working together to upgrade the lighting throughout the stadium to be more environmentally sustainable without losing the quality lighting approach expected for the venue. A great example of improving the energy efficient lighting in the stadium is the service road that runs around the underside of the whole stadium, just under a kilometre in length. The end result was a 150 watt LED alternative with presence detection and dimming functionality. The result was a much brighter service road, delivering around 600,000 kilowatt hours savings per year. One of the highlights of our partnership with Thorne to date is the Wembley arch lighting. Whilst talking to Thorne about the arch lighting, it was suggested that we could change the existing metal halide luminaires to an LED solution, which would allow for individual control of the luminaires, making the arch lighting capabilities more dynamic, bringing the arch to life. The brief from the Wembley Stadium Managing Director was to enable the arch to showcase the new stadium sponsors, e.e. Corporate Colour Aqua, to be able to have a representation of the St George's flag and to keep the arch's iconic white appearance. Following the successful completion of the Arch Colour Change Lighting Project, a more formal partnership was put in place by the directors of Wembley and Thorne. The Arch has always been used to engage with the community, be it the football community, local community, the country or even worldwide, which is why the Arch is so iconic. The new LED lighting combined with the control system has created a platform for us to connect with the fans and spectators within the stadium and outside even more. The arch lighting allows us to highlight winning team colours or goals during the tournament, support concerts and events, or pay tribute to events and charities. For example, we use the arch lighting during NFL games to promote the home team colours, or used during concerts where the arch lighting is controlled by the concert lighting production company. Of course the work doesn't stop here. Customer experience is very important to us here at Wembley and we are always looking for ways that we can use lighting to achieve this. We have a number of projects that we are pursuing including the main entrance floodlights and some colour changing lighting on the concourses. All new lighting has the advantage of being compliant with all necessary lighting performance guides to allow for safe working and for visitors to experience Wembley safely. At present, we control around 80% of the stadium's lighting through a central lighting control system which allows for scheduling lights off and on days ahead and also gives live functionality for control of lights. My aspiration is that during the transition to LED lighting, I will allow for local lighting control, including absence and presence detection, with daylight saving, making our spaces self-governing. Saving energy, reducing maintenance, enhancing the fan experience and meeting the demanding sustainability aims of our world-famous stadium are key to Wembley's future at the heart of both sport and entertainment.